So I'm reading this book called uh, The Secret Life of Words. British sailors are, are looking for this thing called bang lassi. It's made from um, marijuana, marijuana and yogurt. So, so do you have anything? I mean, do you, what's do you have anything that that's kind of inspired by uh, Indian flavors or spices? All my cocktails are. If you if you take a look at it, the very first one right there, the Agni. It's got a Thai chili in it, which has got an Indian influence. Next one down, Amber. Uh, Alfonso mango pulp is in that, which is uh, an Indian uh, mango. Every single one of uh, my specialty cocktails do have an Indian inspiration behind it. Well, cheers, man. That is kind of like a special lassi. Not the pot lassi you were looking for, but. I want the dope lassie. Dope. It's a it's a Dutch word from dupe. And what is what is so dupe, mean? dupe means sauce. <laughs> My friend Dessa talks a lot about the peripatetic technique, Ooh. where because you're walking and fully engaged consciously on with that task, it allows the rest of you to kind of roam free. You know that's funny because I've recently had a, a kind of a revelation about multitasking. And I don't know if I can really explain it, but I'll try briefly. Okay. One of the main functions of consciousness is to give us the illusion that our experience is smooth and continuous. When we were babies and our mom walked into the other room, it was like she vanished yeah. from reality. Right, right. Now we're pretty much aware that if someone walks behind a tree, they still exist. We kind of have this sense that they've walked continuously instead of walking, vanishing, and then walking again. I think that when people are multitasking with kind of like rational type stuff, they are engaging our brain's uh, uh, ability to trick us into thinking that we're smoothly and continuously experiencing something. When in fact, when you multitask, you're just doing a little smidgen of it, this, and then a smidgen of that, and then a smidgen of the first thing, and then a you're doing little gappy bits, right. but you're having this illusion that you're continuously doing two things at once. You wanna hear a really good thing to do? I tell everybody this over and over again. Take a week-long news fast. Don't read the paper, don't watch the television, when you turn the news back on a week later, nothing has changed. Everything is exactly the same. That's the problem with this globalism thing too, right? Like there is a war started like all the time, right? On the front of the AOL page, there's this thing that says, you know, woman's horrible fate. Right. And then the next thing is like, you know, see shocking photos. Every day there's the, the word shocking is on the front of the AOL thing. Like right. how stupid is everyone? Are we really that shocked every right. single day? Doesn't shock come from chakra, which means energy? <laughs> Thank you.